Okay guys, I just want to do, uh, give you an update on the Kinky Curly slash Whole Foods um, situation. First I wanted to say thank you everybody for being so supportive and leaving the comments that you left um, about the Kinky Curly. Um, yeah, it's just not for me. And it was funny because I, um, I have a good friend, I think I've mentioned her in one of my other videos, who has... Um, I don't know, probably 2B, 3A, silky natural hair, and she wanted to try the Kinky Curly, so she was happy that I tried it and was able to tell her, you know, don't do it, um, because her hair is also thin, so, um, you know, it just, I don't think it would have been able to, uh, you know, withstand the weight of uh, the Kinky Curly, but anyway, so let me tell you. I'm in love with Whole Foods now because they took it back, they gave me a credit with no problem. Um, and get this, uh, the gentleman that was there told me that he doesn't know what's going on, he doesn't know if they changed their formula or what, but he's been getting a lot of those back. As a matter of fact, he pulled another jar out from underneath the counter where the return area is and showed me another jar that somebody returned like yesterday or the day before, I guess. So. You know, I explained to him, I said, I don't think it's that they changed their formula. I think it's just that, you know, it's all the rave in the natural hair community and people are trying it, but it's one of those thin things that's too expensive to try and then have not work. Um, plus, you get this big giant jar of it, and if you're never going to use it again, it just seems like a waste. So anyway, um, he was like, wow, you know, that's great feedback. He had natural hair, too. Uh, he had locks, so it was a pretty cool conversation. Anyway, um, they gave me a credit, took it back, no questions. He said with um, used bath and body products, all they ask is that you have your receipt if you've used it. If you haven't used it, then um, I guess you don't even need a receipt. So um, it worked out, and I got two bottles of my EO leave-in conditioner, they didn't cost me 40 bucks. It was like $17, I think, for two. Um, but these will last me for a couple months. And um, I'm good to go. So, again, I just want to say thank you, everybody, for your support and give you an update and let you know that Whole Foods rocks. <laughs> All right. Bye.